Father? No, never! No, I suspect the order for my ex- Perhaps one of Burgred's final orders before he was deposed. That would surprise me. Burgred was battling Danes until the end. He had bigger things to worry over. Perhaps you're right, he's too contained. It must have been King Alfred, then. King Alfred of Wessex? That's another kingdom entirely. Yes, but Alfred has a fearful hatred of the Danes. He must have heard that I am courting one. A beauty who knows no equal. Your Dane lady love. Right. Here's Lincoln, the city of Best my birth, the cauldron of my present sorrows. Mercian guards everywhere. Follow me. Right behind you, Shadow Walker. My heart beats like the drums of your drag. Let's be knowing you. Walt! You chose death! Oh, how can a place I once called home look so alien to me now? So harsh and unwanting. Fear not, Lincoln. I shall make you my... ...in again. Town was your home? It was, and should still be. Oh, to see it now fills my eyes with tears. Save weeping for prayers. Outside. One day I won't have to skulk around this town with my face hidden. I will walk proudly among the people I love. How was your father the last time you saw him? He was. to buy peat from those bandit smugglers. They hoard everything.
Hunwald! Praise God, you live! I do, my dear Reagan hair. Body and soul. Tell my father his son has returned and in fighting form. It is urgent I speak with him. I'm sorry, Lord, but your father has been taken. Taken? When? Weeks ago, Lord. And well ill he was when they carried him off. I wish I could say more. Have you looked for him? Oh, I dare not go asking after him, for fear of stepping above my caste. But he'll be in good hands, don't you worry. Up there with the abbess and her sisters and all. He still has friends in Lincoln. That's a good sign. Bishop Herivrith among them. He's kept a vigil at the town hall, looking after things in your father's absence until he returns. Will we find trouble there? At the town hall? You mean soldiers and the like? Aye. There have been many, many more about since your father took his leave. Right. We'll find a quiet way in if we can. Who was that fellow? Reagan hair? He's an old fixture of my family's household. Loyal to the end. He helps run the place, and he's known me since I was but a little lordling. A simple fellow, but worth every pinch of his salt. Lincoln seems a good place to trade. Does he? The market is flush with goods. Yes, it must be. Growing up, we never wanted for anything in my father's home. Bread and poultry and field fruits of all manner. I suppose this is where our servants purchased them. Lincoln's boon was ours as well. How often did you leave your house, Unwald? Oh, from time to time. Yes. Tabas and Feli solo tumuit armis venit pluviali. Vel fortibis auida mores necne.
My lord, you're well. Lord Hunwar, you should have sent forewarning of your return. Why so surprised to see my ret- Oh, worse than dead. It is my reluctant- Hunbald came to me for- I am simply worried that Lord Hunbi- I have no patience for insult and rumor. We have come to speak with Lord Hunbior. That is all. Lord Hunbior has gone, I'm afraid. He would not say where to, but I'm sure he will return shortly. Once the storm has- What on earth do you mean by that? What storm? Your father feared for his life, Hunwald. In his weakened state, he could not defend him- How dare you! Eivor is above reproach. See this from my view, Hunwald. You arrive after a strange absence with a hired Viking. This does not, in my estimation, imply... Be if I meant to murder... Such violence. Good heavens. God's... Hunwald, your father was at my hospice for a time, but he left of his own accord without saying a word... Come, Abbas, Lord, to his scaring thoughts. There is nothing more of use we can say to him. Take care, my boy. Stay within these walls where you're safest. I'll have a look around, see what I can learn about your father. If my father spent time at the hospice here, the healers who work there may know something. 